Hey, good morning. Welcome back. Just pollinated this sugar pumpkin up here. It's the one that's almost to the middle. Just amazing how them things are growing. Give you a little update here. Had two butternut, and I found a little male. There's the stem of it right there. But I did find a little butternut squash male, and I hit this one here just for good measure. Hit this one here, this one up here. Three more butternut. Look at that guy. Look at that little guy. Looks like he got some bugs or something in on here too, but I have to find out what those are. But, uh, pumpkins start to open up there, get orange in the ridges. These pumpkins are so cool. Pumpkins galore. Got another butternut down there on the end. It's gonna get ready to open up. I think we actually hit that one, the flower's falling off. Getting quite, getting quite the number of pumpkins. I'm glad we're seeing some of these butternut growing. A few of these down here, they must have stunted because they're already turning brown. That plant's not as looking healthy as, you know, this guy here. Everything's looking pretty good. Minus a few of those things. A lot of tomato flowers. Tomatoes are just going nuts. Let me uh, back out here so you kind of get a look how tall all this stuff is. I mean, we're we're up to these wood supports all the way around. That one's climbing up to the middle. I mean, he's right there. He's at the middle, and I put up some pink string. You can see that pink string. Just kind of looped it all the way down. I'm going to have him crawl all the way down that middle support. Thought that would be fun. Still nothing on this seed tray over here. Not sure why not. Started these roots. You know, are some of these shoots suckers off the tomato plant we'll have her dad I think take some of those we are getting some in these pots so I had a few seeds take got our New Mexico peppers here we're getting a true leaf Focus. Getting a true leaf down there now on both those pepper plants. German stripe are still doing good. And we are waiting. Waiting for some flowers. I think we're getting super close. But we did hit everything in here. Push some fish, fertilizer. Work my way down here, but you saw, you know, some yellowing on the outside of the leaves. You can see it a little bit there still, but it really cleared up that yellowing on the leaves. Getting that green back on the leaves, you can just see it on the edge there. But uh, looking good. Have to do that more regularly, I think. Before you see a problem, you know, prevent a problem. Look at these beef steaks. Beef steaks are looking good. Well, I gotta take you down to them brandy wines. Gotta take you down there to those brandy wines. It's getting kinda hard to walk in some of these pathways. Gotta tie some more strings up. Step over into our brandy wines down here. Look at those guys. There's three of them in here. Those are the big two. Big old wrinkly, wrinkly guys. They are looking good. Still a lot of male flowers down there. Cucumbers are, you know, 
cucumber in the back there springing up. Got a couple of tiny cucumbers on it. Let's zoom in here. So I go by and just kind of tap the flower, hopefully shake them around. Get that cucumber in the middle there growing. Sorry if it's hard to hear me. Got the fan going. It's already warm in here. Already warm in here. Lots of cherry tomatoes. Everywhere. Go back down here to the numero uno. OB1. Here's Obi-Wan and his buddies. Be one with my salad. Uh, cluster down here now. Hello. Well, thanks for tuning in. Kind of a short little update here. Glad to see some of these uh, butternuts coming back. Gotta watch out for those male flowers. Got one there. Got a new one coming here. That one I think probably die. Didn't get pollinated. This guy looks like it may have a chance. Maybe we got to it in time. That little flower that we found. But uh, yeah, the male flowers just so hard to hard to come by. Not sure why. Maybe maybe more fertilizer. Kick out some more flowers. But we got a you know, butternut there in the back there. This guy here. So uh, gotta do some research and uh, see what we can do to maybe get some more flowers going. More males to female or pollinate these females and uh, catch us on the next one. See if we figured something out. And I'll see you on the next update. Thanks for tuning in.